Hello everyone, welcome to our channel and welcome to Friday. Hope everyone is doing okay today. Um, Ben's just gone on this bus. Um, we kept Sammy at home today because he had a bit of a temperature yesterday, didn't he? Mm -hmm. And he's also got a bit of one today. He keeps saying he's got a headache. So we just kept him off, Ben if it was out. Um, so he sat on the sofa playing with his tablet. So we'll give him some cow and see how he goes. Anyway, yeah, so today is... Just a general housework day, really. We've got loads of housework to do. Um, and uh, shopping down Tesco's as well. Oh, yeah, going to do some shopping down Tesco's because we're Morning, busy. Morning, guys. Hi. Hello, yes, it's me. <laughs> yes, it's Friday and uh, it's another day off for me today. I know, you've got a nice few days off, haven't you? Which is tell nice. you what, I've enjoyed the last couple of mornings I've been laying. <laughs> <laughs> Not getting up half past. Tell you what, after yesterday, there's no way you'd be able to get up half past four this morning, would you? I'll tell you what, I just, you know. Um, you know, I wouldn't mind being in that situation again where you didn't have to get up so blooming early. It's just not right, is it? It's not actually. It's not, it isn't healthy to get the half past four in the morning. Mm. So, well, yes, I was saying, so, um, um, I've got the grass to cut today. Yeah. We've got tidying up to do in there today. Got loads, did, as I've said, um, has got a melt of wash more. I've <laughs> got today. loads of washing to get done because, so um, while it's dry outside, you can get some clothes out, can't you? I can do actually, because obviously, um, but out all day yesterday and my birthday, I didn't feel like doing anything. Um, we've neglected the housework, so that is our plan for today. See, so yes, the first job for today is you can see Stephen's cutting the grass. Um, you say you're going to cut the grass now, didn't you? Before I hate this garden, guys, I tell you, I've had <laughs> 10 years of trying to get this right. I know, but no, I ain't got no motivation for doing a garden. Oh, no. I think because it isn't flat, is it? I don't think it doesn't help. Just, you know, you should have left it as it was when we first moved in. Well, we were, it wasn't safe for Ben, there was it? It was all the hedges and things. And so, anyway, let's just leave Stephen to cut the grass. He wants to get some clippers cut around my strawberry plants. I was picking the plants. We have to re put these back out again because um, obviously these ones were slow growing for some reason, I don't know why. No, that one is, I think that must be the button that's squash. I just imagine I haven't got a clue. So, anyway, you could just see how much rain you've actually had because that bucket was actually full of water, actually overflowed. And even the watering can overflowed as well. Um, I don't think these, um, when it been here, I don't know the rain it was, I might have gone to take the soil in the um what's there, in the garden waste bin i'm gonna keep the pots for next year as well so yeah so there's our potatoes they're growing really nicely yeah um <laughs> it's starting to flower now so hopefully we'll get some potatoes soon ah tomatoes are there not doing very well this year tomatoes for some reason i'm not sure why so these are our uh, brussels we've had to take the clutches off obviously because they was just grown too big um this is the first year actually growing brussels believe it or not you can see, actually see they're starting to grow bits in the middle. There are cabbages growing quite nicely. Um, for some reason our cucumbers, leeks and carrots didn't grow in the clutch here. So I don't know if maybe the um, bears grabbed them, I do not know. More tomatoes, I mean tomatoes, more potatoes. What's always seem to grow in here is potatoes. And then down here... We've got our cauliflower. These are growing quite nicely, aren't they, Sammy? Yeah. Our sweet corn. And then our leeks. And red onions are growing really nicely. And here those sweet tart. Here's the plants you've planted, aren't they? Yeah. In your right pots. Right near your slide. Right near your slide, yeah. Um, pumpkins there. You want the beans there. Someone's been eating them. I don't know, maybe you saw caterpillars or something, I do not know. But as you can see, they started to entwine. Up on the plants now, aren't they? Yeah. You like growing runner beans, don't you? You need to stop recording because do that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Bum 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 bum
the grass. Did you cut it all right? Was it too wet? It's too wet. Is it too wet? It still looks nice, eh? Yeah, but nothing collected inside the uh, in the basket bit on the floor. Now. Oh, didn't it? So it's supposed to look by hand. Yeah. No, basically what it done, it's uh, it sprayed it back out again. Oh, was it? Yeah. So great with this little... thing is, like I say, it does look nice when it's been cut. You do have to admit that. I'm not leaving my trampoline there, are you? Moving it back? No, it's staying there for now because that's a flat, a nice flat area. You can see all. Oh all, yeah, it's flat all there. All four sides of the, all three sides of the bottom bits are flat on the bottom. Okay, nice flat area. You know what well, that is, it because that's where the conifer trees have started to. Um, yeah, the, gr rock. The, the ground is sinking at the bottom. That's good, isn't it? <laughs> um, <laughs> anyway, can you put my rotary line in, please, so I can put my washing out? Yeah, yeah is that all right? So yeah, we're just in Tesco's now. Um, doing for the scanning shop, the scanning shop. Why don't we put them in the do that way? Mm. You used to not doing, aren't you? Sammy loves doing the scanning shop, don't you, see her? Yeah. So. Well, no, normally not got Sammy with us. Normally we have, don't we? <laughs> Sammy's an added extra today, aren't we? On the not figure. Yeah. yeah. Hello. Well. You've been poorly, haven't you? Um. Do you get a TV book? Which one are you gonna get? TV satellite week. TV. What's what was why? I like this one. You've gone there, and I suppose so, because you've been poorly. Well, let's, look, well, let's scan it. Stick it in. How much is that now? £2.35 for a magazine. Expensive. Donuts, no. Stay away from some donuts. Oh, Sammy, they've still got one here. I didn't think they have. Oh, Sammy. Yeah. See what they've got? Sorry, sorry, full sticker. Oh, Sammy, you've allowed it. So I allowed it. Do you want it? Yeah. You know what it's like with sticker books. You're going to do it? Where's the barcode? How much is that? Three ninety nine. Got it. That's your pocket money for the week then. All right, mm. that one. A number of magazines. I say, how many stickers you got anyway? Do you want that? Yeah. Why is that? Mm. What's the matter? Yeah, let him have that. He knows he likes his stickers, mm. doesn't he? Just yeah. find somewhere for the stickers. Hope someone does the stickers. Ones. You want these ones? <laughs> 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 I know. That's what Sam likes his stickers, doesn't he? Yeah, I'll match it How much are they now? Uh, it's quid. That's expensive. Yeah. Isn't it really expensive, that one is? Sam, you used to buy them magazines. Yes, yeah, Sammy. Yeah, Thomas you, you, that. yeah Pepe, 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 Pepe. Thomas, Pepe, Pins. You don't have them in one now, do you? BBC book. Yeah. You know what the Fools magazine is? There's a car on the Fools. I want the top girl. You're not having top gear. You're not having top gear, no. <laughs> is there a Fools magazine out? No. I don't tell um, Sam. So I'm just looking for a bath mat because Ben had a little accent in the bath yesterday. Um, they've got any here. Can't see any, can they? It's typical. We wanted to do vein pillows. We couldn't find it. Now we don't need any. They've got some. We'll have to go to our good old friend Amazon then. <laughs> We're going to have to go to Amazon, aren't we? Mm. Tell you what, we watched that on my birthday, which is really good. It's really funny, that is, isn't it? Sammy. Love that. It's really good. And that's good film, that. Yeah. Um, Instant family. I'm surprised Sammy doesn't into the watching the Lego movie yeah, that now. Lego movie, look. Yeah. yeah. He's into Lego City now, isn't he? I'm surprised she hasn't bought that yet. I am actually, that's one I haven't got. I was waiting for to come out with a slip cover. Yeah. That's the only one that hasn't come out with a slip cover. But you can buy them on a digital download. You can, it's just easy to buy them on a digital download. Wait, right, Lucita, can you go get some bananas? Sammy, can you go get some bananas, please, sweetheart? Oh, yeah. It's just on the reduced price section now, so there is. Um, one pound seven is not worth it for bananas. Oh. Pizza, you love your pizza. Pizza stuff from that Audi thing. We have actually, haven't we? When there was mm. enough. Uh, oh, okay, it's the mints. That's not bad actually. There you go. It's three pound twenty nine. Can you get that? I stick that in the freezer actually. Um, still got some chops in the freezer anyway. Um, Do you want some sausages, Sammy? Yeah. I thought you like the frozen ones. I want the frozen sausages. You like frozen sausages, don't you? We do. It's going in the bacon. You can't go without buying bacon. No, I can't. I can't live without my bacon, actually. So what sort of we did buy? Those ones are nice, Have You like those ones, those crumbling no, ones. It. Hang on, see what my daddy wants first. See if he wants those ones or those ones, actually. It's hard, isn't it? Well, with the release of Toy Story 4 this weekend, and uh, Sammy's claimed... 
the Toy Story 4 sticker album oh, wow. off of us while we were down Tesco's. Yep. Didn't you? Yeah. You like doing stickers? Oh, well, look what we found! That. Found Forky! So let's open all these, shall we? We've got, we've got, they've got trading stickers, they've got cards, or say stickers, and also trading cards yeah. as well. So the trading cards are pretty cool, don't they? They're still made by Panini. I don't know. He makes, yeah, what's at the bottom? The buzz. Yeah, Panini. It's still the same old logo, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. So one thing that hasn't changed over the years, guys, is these sticker books. <laughs> um, okay. Yeah, we always, we always used to love our stickers. You can't tell me who never used to love doing sticker books when they were younger. I remember all the... Um... Westside, not Westside. We all the um, take that ones and poison ones I used to get. Well, they all Panini ones. I think so. Mm. You used to have the wrestling ones. The wrestling ones as well, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, really? comment below, guys, if you used to do the old sticker books when you were younger. <laughs> you don't get many in the packet, though. Yeah, I used to be a mad one on the football ones. Wait, this week, tell us what number do we need to look for? <laughs> number 46. Go on, then. Go on, then. Let's turn it over. Let's find 46 in our book. Well, the biggest question, three. Sammy, is you going to complete this? Well, then we 46 on there. That's it, let's pull it off. Stick it in them. Stick it in there. And your problem is, mm. you're doing this now, dip in the spore of the book. <laughs> what number do we need now? Four. What number? 101. 101. Where's 101? What's that? What are these things here? Well, these are different, aren't they? I've got one here. No, where are we? Uh, 101, where are we? 101. Here we go. And then who's on the back of that one? Stinky dog. Stinky dog. Who likes stinky dog? I like it. No, you, who else likes stinky dog? Ben loves. Ben loves stinky dog, doesn't he? What number's this one? Number 13. Number 13. Where's number Okay, there's 113. I'll take the sticker off. Take the sticker off. Mummy, you can help. I'll help. Let's take the sticker off. Mm. You're going to buy some more of those stickers? Are you going to buy some more of these? Yeah. I think so. I don't know who sells them actually. Mm. One day I'll buy some McCool's. more. McCall's. What's the question, so? Well. Um, what number's that one? What number? What number? 70. 70 what? Where are we? Oh, for you do what? It's in those. Oh, they? Look, those are the trading cards. Mm. Oh well. Nice square, isn't it? This little. Mm. I suppose that's the pack. He's probably. Sorry, so what number was we? What number was we? Seventy-seven. Seventy-seven. Yeah, and Toy Story Four's out in cinemas today. I hope you're going. Hopefully, we're going to see it on Sunday, aren't we, sweetheart? Sometimes just say yeah. Well, it depends on that I suppose, because Ben doesn't like busy crowds and not being nasty. The AJ near us, I don't think he's doing it, is it? That's the next one. Yeah. How many how many stickers do you have in a packet? It used to be six. It's about four. Um, potato. I didn't really have much potato in the bottom, did you? Hang on, so there's a couple there. There you go, that's a bit better. But there's five, I think. Yeah. Five or six. What number's that? Five. Number five. On there, stick it in. What are we doing? That's it, put it back in properly. That's it, oh dear. <laughs> it's not being normal, look. I find sometimes when you don't put them in properly, you have to, you know what I mean? Yeah. What number is this one there, Sammy? Um, 92. 92. I think we use next time to put back into order. In order. Yeah, the biggest problem with having sticker books when you were younger, you used to get so many swaps. I know. And you used to take them to school with you and try and trade them in, see if you had, had this and that. Listen, I do have to admit, I know when some of the frozen ones before, it's actually collected all, it's actually collected them all, hasn't he? Yeah. Go on then, put the sticker off. I'm just That's it, put the sticker off. That's it. Having this frozen on the floor. Stick on them. That's it. So yeah, we still got quite a few to do, but I do like these trading cards. These Nine to two. That's what we'll do on the floor, isn't it? Ready? What number should we do now? Okay. 
I see 94 on there. She's put 94 on. Yeah? That's it. Mm. Stick on them. So instead of you getting sweeties, you grab stickers instead. Yeah. Okay, you heard that. <laughs> so if I was, instead of having sweeties, you want stickers. And this sort of one. What are you looking for? What have we got there? 37. 37. I will do it. You do it then. You do it. What's 37 on that page? Well, take a stick off then. No help because. Oh, Sunny! I'll be careful we get through from that way. That's it. Now stick it on. That's a good boy. Does he have 32 years somewhere? I did actually. Okay. Half 38, 40, and 41 is still going the same page. The 6, 38 in first. And then 38. Mm. And then 40. Get 40 in. Uh. And then, oh, look, we done. Three step. And then that number is. Number 41. 41. That's it. We stuck all of our stickers in now. Can we? Yeah. And there yeah. you go, guys. Toy Story 4. Cinemas this weekend, so <laughs> go and see it. <laughs> so, yes, it's four o'clock. We're just waiting for Ben to come home from school. Mm -hmm. Sammy, you feeling better now? Yeah. Yeah? What are you playing? No, I'm on fours now. You're on fours now, aren't you? I'll so, I went to the computer and had lunch. Yeah. What have you got? What have you had in your bowl? Buttons. Have some buttons in your bowl. Yeah. Yeah. So, at least you're feeling better, that's amazing, though, isn't you? Yeah. So, Cal has some really good stuff. There's Stephen, he's editing that video. Um, I'm not editing anything yet. Oh, aren't you? No. Oh, yeah? I'm waiting for Ben to come in because I need to concentrate. I oh, know you do. It's um, in winter, Mama. a review of this thing here. We got sent by Le Leverett. I can't pronounce the name to review, so, uh, so look out for that coming soon. And then there is tea already for us, cottage pie. With some carrots, peas, gravy, mashed potato, and then the um, some cheese on the top. So that would be nice to look forward to the kids absolutely love shepherd's pie. They always ask for more, so I've actually done a bigger portion this time. So if we get any extras, I'll stick it in the freezer, I think. So then, guys, I thought I'd end this one outside tonight. Yeah, look how much better the back garden looks now after it's had its hair cut, shall we say. Yeah. It's amazing how different it looks once it's, you know, been cut and it makes you, makes you feel more better about it. Because <laughs> when it was like that, it looked absolutely terrible. Anyway, the front's been done as well, all nicely trimmed up and looks much better. And uh, yeah, guys, thanks for joining us today. And yeah, not much going on today, just the old doing the Tesco shop today. And Sammy's lays better now, which is great. Sammy's much better now after three or four doses of cow bar. And yeah, he'll be going back to school on Monday. And uh, yeah, quite pleased with how the plants are getting on down there. And uh, hopefully they'll all grow properly. Hopefully, I'm not looking for, um, just listening to the weather forecast. It's going to get really strange next week, isn't it, with the weather? Yeah, we're getting some 40 degree heat pumping up from Africa. So it's coming up Africa, you know, across Spain, coming up France, up towards us. Yeah, I just watched the Met Office video on YouTube and uh, apparently the low pressure's moved over to one side and, you know, it's drifting up a load of warm air coming out of the coming out of Africa, so they reckon we're gonna could get to forty degrees somewhere in the country next week. Yeah, and, that, that and that's gonna set off some really, really nasty thunderstorms apparently. So they, I'm not really looking forward to those. Don't they reckon it could be tropical storm weather or something some places, don't they? But they're gonna be hit and miss showers, aren't they? Yeah, if they hit and miss showers, if you do get one, I reckon we're gonna, you could have a month's worth of rain in two, and... In two, in two hours? In an hour, he said, sure. Was it now? It yeah. Two hours? yeah, a month's worth of rain in an hour, large hailstones, stones, violent f storms, or oh, really not looking forward to that. And they reckon this light storms could take out the power, don't they? So that'd be fun. Yeah, so fun and games next week, guys. And uh, if we can catch any, like thunderstorms or anything on the vlog or try and do it we tried it yeah yeah so yeah as we know today is the longest day of the year so after today it's going to start the lightness is going to start disappearing a minute per day 
and then it will start to get darker and darker again and as we get into the autumn so scary to think we're halfway through the year now aren't we Cheryl? Yeah, yeah. The longest day point is always the halfway point of the year and uh, yeah to think that you know it's silly to say that you could say it's only six months till Christmas. I know yeah it's scary because <laughs> five weeks ago um, because didn't our journey take us part that bit which got flooded. It did actually down there yeah. Yeah anyway guys yep yeah, thanks for joining us today and uh, yep yeah, we will see you tomorrow for Saturday at seven o'clock. Bye guys. See you tomorrow.